Hello, everyone. Um, the next topic is uh, related to monitoring and, uh, and alerts of thought. And uh, what we're going to see is uh, some of the monitoring that we have around the database now. And to do that, uh, you can see the feature that was uh, requested. Basically, we wanted to have all the components before um, a release to be in checked in terms of the um, database scheme at present. So not just the, I mean, the image version needs to be correct, but we want to make sure that all the components that talk to the database have the correct schema in terms of uh, storage, basically. And uh, how do we how do we do that? Uh, we introduce uh, some new metrics that we expose in Metric Exporter, and you can see these metrics available in our um, dot service metric dashboard. So in this dashboard, you can see the version of each of the component and which libraries of thought libraries are using. So you can kind of see what is happening in the different uh, components. But Do you then... want to show something? Oh, yeah, sorry. Ah, cool. <laughs> Thank you, Christoph. <laughs> um, yeah, can you see my screen? Uh, it's loading, yes. It's uh, very small okay. again. So. Um, I don't know if we can, this can go up. Yes, it goes. Can you see better? I yes, assume yes. so. Okay. So what I was saying uh, related to the schema that we want to uh, have, this is the feature that was uh, uh, created. And what you can see now in the dashboard, which is called the service metrics, is all the version of the components. So you basically can, here you can see where there is a switch between version of some components. When you see these uh, spikes that appear here. And uh, when we talk about the database schema instead, we introduce this uh, revision scripts. So you can, you can see that uh, for each of the component, we expose the version of the database that is uh, available, the head of the Alembic version present. And uh, in Metric Exporter, instead, we expose both the database one and the one present in the in the component. So as you can see, right now there are most of the components which have the same version, except for Investigator, and also actually Graph Backup Job. Um, and this means that uh, uh, we need to update that. And how do we discover that? We select this. We introduce these alarms. And uh, the alarms basically just uh, are triggered if any of this uh, um, metric goes to one. So now when in, we know that investigator in uh, uh, stage does not have the correct uh, um, version of the database in this case, so we need to make uh, take action on that and uh, basically update the version. And um, that's it. Maybe the other thing is still related to the database, and uh, it is something that was added to the Postgres um, dashboard, and is related again to the database data, and this is here. So Kevin introduced a new metric related to AIM check, and also in this case we have an alarm. So if there is any corruption in the database. Um, we would receive an alarm related to this uh, specific metric. And that's all. Thank you. Any question? Yes, so um, it's deployed to the um, internal data hub, right? And I think if we deploy to the MOC environment, we can also use the um, Prometheus Alert Manager GitHub uh, Gateway, right? So we could have the bot open an issue if the database schema is out of date. Yes. Yes, as a double check of uh, of a release. I mean, yes. Cool. Any other question? Thanks, Francesco. Thank you.